It's Charisma here, and I have big, big news. Wait, you can like see all my business. Okay, if I look a little frazzled, this is why. I recorded a video that I have yet to upload, and oh wait, did I upload? Okay, I did upload it, and I said, oh well, you know, if if it goes well, I'll tell you guys how it is. All right. So basically, what I've been doing is I've been trying to work for Mac. Yes, Mac. Now, I went through the channels of, you know, of going through Nordstrom. Now, the process is a little bit different from apparently going, when you just work for a Mac counter. Or even in a Mac in like a Bloomingdale's or a Macy's. When you go through Nordstrom, you have to go through Nordstrom. First, I had an interview with the head of HR. Passed that interview, no problem. About a week passed, and the woman that's like the cosmetics manager, she called me. Interview went great. And this was today. Today is Monday. I guess is this the 25th or the 26th? I don't know, but it's Monday. And the interview went well. You know, it seemed like she liked me. You know, she said, you know, if it doesn't work out with Mac, um, you should try for Bare Essentials. I don't really want to do Bare Essentials or Bare Minerals or whatever because, you know, I don't feel like. I mean, I don't really believe in the brand. I don't, you know, I like my makeup to be seen and not just to be like, oh. It has like three colors of foundation, but whatever. That's just not the case. So she said, you know, I'm going to get, pass your application on to the, um, I guess, the ROM of Mac. Fine. The woman called me from Mac no more than an hour after I left. She's like, yeah, you know, my name is blah, blah, blah. You know, do you want to come in for interview tomorrow at 4.30? Mind you, I have to work at 6. The mall that I work at is like, it almost seems like it's two different ends of the world. Like my, my mall that I work at, it's one way and this mall is another way. This mall is closer to my house, the one that the Mac store, I mean the Mac counter is that it's close to my house, but the other one is close to my school. So I have to work at 6 and this interview is at 4.30. I'm very nervous. I had to try to find a model at the last minute. Um, I asked my sister. My, both my sisters have to work. One works from 11 to 6 and one has to be working at 5. So that's not going to work. I asked their friend. You know, I chose to do somebody's makeup who I've worked with before and it won't be that easy for me to have to think of the products. So basically what I'm asking YouTube, my subscribers, whoever's watching this video, my interview is tomorrow, Tuesday, whatever day, because my watch has the wrong date. I want to say it's no, to, today the 27th. Yeah, so tomorrow the 28th. I have an interview with Matt. I have to bring my model, do the makeup interview, and... Hopefully it goes well. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty much confident in my skills with what I'm doing, but it's just nerve-wracking because, you know, it's like Mac has such high standards of, you know, their employees, and it's just something that I really, really want to do. And I know you guys probably never heard me talk this fast or excited, but when I get excited about stuff, I tend to talk really fast. So if you guys have any advice on what I should do, you know, how I should behave, whatever, you know, just let me know, leave comments down below, direct message, message me, whatever, because this has been a dream of mine, and I'm very excited, I really, really, really want this job, because it's just gonna just only open so many doors for me, and it's like, I'm just very, very excited, so, wish me luck, and leave your comments down below, how you think, you know, what I should do, and how the interview should go, in the meantime, I'm just gonna, Search on the internet for blogs and, you know, comments of people who have interviewed for Mac and all that good stuff. But anyway, see you guys later. Bye.